Just weeks after selling his Malibu beach house at a massive $36 million loss, Kanye West has turned heads by purchasing a new ultra luxe estate in Beverly Hills exclusive Beverly Park North community. This $35 million mansion offers a fresh start, boasting nearly seven acres of privacy, 20,000 square feet of modern interiors and enough space to park an army of cars. Curious to see what Kanye's latest home has in store? Well, this one might just top them all. Before Kanye West splurged on his new Beverly Hills retreat, the rapper had been living a slightly quieter lifestyle, renting a modest condo with his wife Bianca Sensori. The two kept a relatively low profile, well, at least about where they were living, choosing this understanding space as a retreat away from the public eye. The reportedly $12,000 per month rental was located in West Hollywood and was said to span just over 1,800 square feet of space, offering one bed and one and a half baths. While the rented condo offered a simpler way of life, Kanye's return to the luxury market with this new Beverly Hills estate signals a shift back to his over-the-top tastes. Clearly, he's ready to embrace a larger, more extravagant home base once again. After selling his Malibu home at a massive $36 million loss, Kanye expanded his real estate portfolio with a new property in Los Angeles. He recently sold his designer Malibu home for $21 million to a California house flipping firm, a significant drop from the over $57 million that he initially paid. Now he's added a luxurious mansion in the exclusive Beverly Park North gated community to his holdings. The off-market deal shows that Kanye spent $35 million on the 20,000 square foot estate. Originally built back in 2000 for Perfect 10 magazine founder Norman Zada and designed by acclaimed architect Richard Landry, the mansion was once owned by a Saudi banker as well. Kanye's grand estate is tucked away on nearly seven acres of lush grounds with two motor courts that are capable of accommodating dozens of vehicles. The main house features 11 bedrooms and 18 bathrooms accessed through a soaring foyer with a chandelier centerpiece. Generously sized living areas are flooded with natural light here, complemented by a kitchen equipped with granite countertops, stainless steel appliances, and a breakfast nook. The secluded master suite offers a custom closet and a luxurious bath with a soaking tub and window line spa. Outside, Kanye's new sprawling estate comes with two pools, a sports court, and a separate guest house. There is also an entertainment pavilion connected to the main house by a futuristic steel column bridge. With a $3,300 per month HOA fee, this estate offers a private and opulent lifestyle in one of Beverly Hills' most posh communities. Now, let's not forget about the home that Kanye just took a major loss on. Back in spring, the rapper reduced the asking price of his minimalist Malibu mansion to $39 million after first listing it at $53 million. Despite the eye-watering price, the 4,000 square foot concrete home designed by famed architect Tadeo Ando faced backlash from architecture enthusiasts due to the sad state Kanye left it in. Kanye had originally planned to renovate the property after purchasing it for $57.2 million in 2021, but he abandoned the project shortly after gutting the interiors, leaving the home exposed to the elements. The result? A bare concrete shell, with floor to ceiling windows removed, rooms stripped down, and even plumbing and electricity dismantled. The listing, managed by celebrity agent and Selling Sunset star Jason Oppenheim, describes the property as needing substantial work to either restore or reimagine the interiors. Despite its current state, the home kept Ando's signature minimalist style, featuring smooth concrete and tons of natural light. From the street, it appears fortress-like with a concrete front and frosted glass, while the beach-facing side shows pivoting glass walls and stairs leading to outdoor spaces in the ocean. Built in 2013, this architectural gem is constructed with approximately 1,200 tons of concrete, 200 tons of steel, and 12 large pylons driven more than 60 feet into the sand making it a lasting structure on the California coast. With the property sitting on the market for some time, Kanye's decision to cut the price to $39 million came as little surprise. 
However, Bellwood Investments, a California-based real estate firm, ended up purchasing the mansion for $21 million, a whopping $36 million less than Connie's original purchase price. Bellwood CEO, Bo Belmont, announced plans to invest an additional $5 million to restore the home to Ando's original design, aiming to revive the unique piece of architectural history. Kanye West's real estate shows his bold and often unpredictable approach to both business and design. While some investments, like his architectural Malibu beach home, have led to significant losses, Kanye continues to make high-profile moves in the luxury real estate market, like his new $35 million Beverly Hills home purchase. That'll bring today's house tour to an end, but thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and we'll see you in another video. Bye! As you know, before they were famous has partnered with Mogul Productions, allowing you access to Hollywood events and film sets, giving you the ability to crowdfund either as an investor or as a creator. We are talking producer credits or red carpet events. You can even get a walk-on role in an upcoming feature film that will be released theatrically. No more Hollywood gatekeepers. Mogul Productions is making your Hollywood dreams accessible via Web3 and a strong, connected community. We are also working with musical acts like Rello Ronzano. Haven't heard of him? Well, we just released his Before They Were Famous, which also included an in-depth interview. Mogul Productions has teamed up with Rello for his debut album release, Can't Escape the Allure. No matter what, you can't escape the allure. This isn't just an album launch, it's a revolutionary opportunity for early supporters to share in Rello's success, earning a portion of the album's profits. To make things even more interesting, Mogul is doing a token airdrop for those who want to get involved with this project and invest in Mogul Productions. What you need to do is sign up for the whitelist now via Daily.io. Once this is done, comment done on this video and your Zaley username in the comments here and you will be entered to win mogul tokens. These will allow you to spend some coin on future campaigns like being a walk-on actor in a future movie. Heck, I'll even fly out with you. We have tons of collaborations and projects we'll be working on with mobile in the future, so stay tuned for weekly updates and I'll see you guys in another video.